so I'm really excited to be able to be making this February favorites. Oh my gosh, you have no idea. Like, I didn't think I was going to be able to. Like, a couple weeks ago, I remember I said on Twitter, I don't know if I'll be able to make a monthly favorites. Um, because as some of you may or may not know, I've had surgery. And um, I'm not going to really get into what and why in this video. But maybe I will in another video if you want. So, um, I had pre-recorded videos in January because I knew I was going to be on bed rest for like at least three weeks. But then at the three-week mark, I had some complications. And so I had to get another surgery. And it was like going to be another two weeks. So... Um, I feel good now, um, but I'm kind of low energy, as you can tell, because I'm obviously taking medicine, um, and uh, it's early in the morning. And uh, also, please excuse, as another disclaimer for this video, please excuse my roots, my nails, and my hands being chapped. Um, as you can see, they're super chapped, and um, I wash them a lot, because look how white they are compared to this. So, yeah, it's just because I've been sick, I've been washing them a lot. Not sick, but you know what I mean, like not be able to... Not being able to, um, <laughs> oh my gosh, sorry. I've, I've been, like, only able to, like, sponge bath and stuff, and I actually have to have, like, other people wash my hair. But it's almost done, so thank goodness. Also, please excuse this little black fuzz. I had just dropped this camera, like, a minute ago, and I think the, um, I mean, the phone, because I'm on my phone, I think that's why, so I really won't be able to do videos on my phone anymore. Plus, the quality is not great, I know, so I promise this will be my last one. I will get a new camera just once I'm able to, um, drive again. <laughs> Um, also, you'll notice that most of the stuff is drugstore products because that's the only place I've been, like, getting rides to is the drugstore, so you'll notice that. But they're really great products. These are my favorite. I've gotten a lot of crappy products also this month, but these are my favorites. They're the great stuff that I actually will keep using even after I can start driving and shopping again. So, um, I think that's all my disclaimers, so let's just get into my February favorites. I know I'm a day late, but y'all on Twitter said it's okay to post it the day after the last day of the month, so... Here are my February favorites. I'm going to start with these. These are awesome, awesome. Like, I love these. And if I had never been stranded, or if I never had been stranded, like I have been, like not being able to drive, I would never have found these because I don't really go to drugstore makeup. So I'm really excited. These are the Revlon Lip Butters. You can see the little Rev... Can you see the Revlon? Revlon. They're so pretty. Okay, well, the pretty one, I have the one down here, but they're also good for you. They're like chapsticks but they're lipsticks like you know how chapstick like I actually have a favorite chapstick here but you know how chapsticks is just like kind of boring like you kind of have to put them on top or like you have to put them on and then you can't really put like a color on well these are like the lipsticks by Revlon but like with the lip butter formula so they feel really good which is great because um aside from my chapped hands I've also had really chapped lips just because it's been cold here in California and I'm not really used to it and a lot of times I'll go out with like wet hair or like wet hands you know like I won't dry them completely so same thing with my lips. I lick them a lot. And they're not usually a problem during the summer, but in the winter, they get super chapped. So I love it. And the color I have on today is this Sugar Frosting. Okay, <laughs> 005 is the number. I'm not really good at, like, focusing in on these. Sorry about this. This is super distracting to me, so I'm sure it's distracting to you. But, okay. But they're, like, they're like the texture of, like, a... Um, what do you call it, like a lip lip balm, but they're, like, a color. The pigmentation's amazing. And my hands are so chapped. Otherwise, I would show you, I mean... I mean, it's just really sheer. I mean, you can barely even see it. And, oh, you know what? It's probably my blinds. The lighting's not good. Okay, well, this is not going to be good to be able to show you these products with the bad lighting. Um, but maybe, hold on, let me see if I can open these blinds. Hold on one second. I don't know if that helped or I think, okay, something's wrong with my camera. It's not the lighting. There's obviously something wrong with my camera, so. <laughs> um, but the other colors I got were in Cupcake and Sugar Plum. They're just these pink and purple ones. Um, I love the pinks, obviously. I don't really go into reds or oranges, but they're all really pretty colors. Um, but like I was saying, the pigmentations on these are, like, really good. Like, this is, like, it looks like it could be a matte color to me. It's just so pretty. Um, this one's a lot more pinker, but I don't have it on. But Revlon lip butters are amazing. And sorry. Whoa. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm going too slow or if my energy is, like, way off. Like, I'm serious. I, like, literally just woke up. This is, like, my first video back. So, I'm, like, ah, okay. <laughs> so, if I'm not, like, my normal self, that's why. And I actually feel like I'm getting sick just in general. So, maybe I am. Um, the next thing is these um, EOS lip balms I found at Rite Aid. Um, I think they stand for Evolution of Smooth. And they're really cute. First of all, they just caught my eye because they look like an egg. And I was like, oh my god, those are so cute, what are they? And then I found out they were lip balms. I'm like, okay, cool, I can always use some, like, lip balms, especially because, like, oh, hello, my lips are chapped. And they're just, like, cuter than, like, a stick of chapstick. Um, but look how cute these are when you un undo it, right? You, like, just screw it off. And they're, like, a little egg. It's, like, a little egg, and you just put it on. 
your lips. <laughs> it's so, so cute. I was just like, and they smell really good. This is tropical fruit. This one smells really good. Um, but I love this one so much. I had gotten this at the beginning of the month, and um, I loved it so much, so I went back and I got um, another scent. Um, what is this one? I don't even know what the scent is. I think this was mango. Does it say? It probably says, and I probably can't even see. Oh, my God. It says tangerine right there. Okay. Well, I got tangerine, and, um, you know, it says medicated, so it's, like, good. Is that, yeah. It's like, it's good for your lips too. I mean, probably even better than the lip butters, but the lip butters are the color, which is cool. Um, but this stuff is awesome and it um, is good for like summer too. So I was like, I'll pick up another one. They have like four different colors. So I'll probably come and get the other colors. But these are so cute. Look, you just, a little screw, a little egg. It's cute, huh? I don't know. I love it. I just like, they made me happy. Like little things are making me happy this month because like I said, I haven't been able to do much. I've been like on the couch. So like little products like that have been making me super happy. Um, let's see here. And there's the... I say the packages for some of these things because I wanted to show you how they all come. Okay, so that is that. Um, we'll just finish off my little Rite Aid cosmetics. <laughs> this is like a beauty haul from Rite Aid almost, but um, I love this stuff. This stuff is like really great. I got these Bouncy Blushes by Maybelline. Yeah. Sorry, it's kind of a reflection. This is number 40. Um, they actually only have like three left, so I got this color and this purpley color, but I haven't used the purple color yet, so I don't really know. I'm sorry, my nails are so awful. Um, I literally haven't gotten filled in like a month. Yeah, gross. Um, but this is number 45. Um, it's just like a purple color. But this color I love, and what's cool about these blushes, again, little things have been making me happy. These bouncy blushes, they literally bounce. As you can see, my finger has been in there, but you just take it and um, it bounces. Like, I don't want to flick you off, but... You just push and it bounces. Do you see the, it's hard to see on there. And I'm sorry, my nails are like, oh, they're like distracting me. But it's like this little bouncy thing. And I just put them on the of my cheeks and they give such good color. <laughs> it's a makeup tutorial. But I just, and I think it just gives it more of a natural, um, natural look to it. Like to my face because my face has been really greasy too. Um, again, because it's like I can't wash my hair. Anyways, I'm not going to like repeat myself a million times. But I'm not looking my best. We'll just put it that way. Um, but these blushes are amazing and they're super, they're super inexpensive compared to like, you know, getting Chanel or MAC. They're like seven bucks or something. So, um, I just really thought this color was a pretty color and they're fun. It's like you push on it, like bounce, bounce. <laughs> you just try it. These are good. I mean, it's seven bucks. I mean, seven bucks is a lot of money. I'm not saying like, oh, it's just seven bucks, like waste it. But even my mom was like, okay, I'm going to try it. Like for $7, I'll try it. So those were really cute. Um, and then my final, like cosmetic thing I've been using is this um awesome photo ready concealer by Revlon oh my gosh okay so yeah I don't know about you guys but when you're not feeling like you're 100% self or when you feel like you're like contaminated like I felt like my face was greasy sometimes like I don't like using my good concealer which is Too Faced which I love Too Faced concealer but it's like my good concealer like the stuff where I you know I use it every day but it's like the stuff where I want to like look good for someone or something or just myself this was just more of like oh my god I can't even stand the side of myself I just want to put something over my zits because I was breaking out because of the greasy hair on my face and all that stuff. So I was breaking out the medications and stress and all that. Um, so I didn't want to use my good one. So I got this, like, photo-ready one. And this is amazing. Like I said, I'll probably continue using this even after. I put it on, I mean, obviously I have it on today. But, like, I've been putting it on, like, the acne spots I've been getting. Um, and it's amazing. Like, it covers really, really well. It's super thick. Like, and it comes up like this. And I put it on my hand just so, like, I don't contaminate it anymore. And I just put it, like, on there. And I just like scrape it off and then I'm just going to put this under my eyes. But usually I put it like on my problem areas and it's like been amazing. Like I love it. And then I just like airbrush my foundation over it. So, um, but it gives it such a smooth, um, your face, you're smooth. If you have like bumps or scars, it's like really gives it a smooth, smooth look before you do your foundation, which I, I love. And it's like a cheapo one at the drugstore. So I've been using that all month just because again, my face has been like kind of... Ugh, greasy and I don't want to use like my nice stuff and I haven't really seen anyone like literally it's just for when I put my makeup on around the house because I don't like I do wear makeup around the house because I don't like myself looking ugly you know what I'm saying I mean people are like why would you even wear makeup if you're sick and I'm like you know I don't know I don't like to stand the side of my I don't like to look at myself when I'm not like fully you know something I mean I don't do the full eyeshadow every day but anyways I'm blabbing I'm blabbing Blah. <laughs> okay um so the next thing I have is this Burt's Bees um, blemish, herbal blemish treatment thing, which I love. I don't, I didn't say the packaging, but 
Um, it's like just this blemish stick. And it has a little rolly thing. And obviously you put it on your blemishes. Another thing that's really helpful. I discovered this too late in the month. I just discovered it like two weeks ago. But my skin was a lot worse before I used it. Okay, this video is really long. So I'm just going to go through. My favorite gums of the month are Sean White gum. And these desserts. Oh my god. These taste like apple pie. And this tastes like mint chocolate chip ice cream. So good. Oh my gosh. Um... My favorite drink has been this Rockstar Coconut Water Energy Drink. Amazing. I'm obsessed with Rockstar. So good. It kind of says it all. It sounds gross, but it's really good, and it gives you energy. I haven't drank that yet this morning, so that's why I need more energy. Um, these Clean and Clear Wipes from Hello Kitty I got at Target. Um, they're just the little oil blotter things, so like your makeup doesn't come off, even if your face is greasy or if you don't have powder, which is just, they're just these little blue things. Um, let's see here. Oh, this is just another kind of, this is like a cheapo one. This one's not as good, but this is like the Hello Kitty EOS kind of, but it's not by EOS, and it just kind of screws off and has a little thing, but it's not as good. It's just cute. <laughs> I just thought it was really, really awesome, and I get a lot of compliments. I'm like, what is that? It says chapstick. I'm like, oh, so cute. Um, the Skinny Cows Heavenly Crisps are also my favorite thing. They're like chocolate, and since I've been gaining weight because I haven't been able to exercise, um, I've been trying to like cut my calories where I can, and um, these are awesome. I can't live without chocolate. These Skinny Cows are great. And I'm not sponsored by Skinny Cow. It's literally the YouTubers that are sponsored that have influenced me to buy them, and they're actually very, very good. Um, and I bought these myself. <laughs> and then finally, the Burt's Bees um, Body Butter and Cranberry. It was on sale at Target. That's why I bought it, and it's good for my hands. I literally just started using this a week ago, too, so it's kind of, I don't know, too late. But, okay, that was a really long video. I wanted to keep it under 12 minutes. I'm almost there, so um, sorry I kind of rushed it through the end, but I'll put all the stuff that I got in the thing below. Um, and let me see your favorite February favorites. Okay, bye. <laughs>